BBYO is defined by some remarkable people who throughout the organization's history have allowed it to do the incredible things that it currently does today. At a moment of transition, a woman named Lynn Schusterman with the strength of the Schusterman Family Foundation stepped in and encouraged BBYO to be great and to be bold and to reach young people in new and exciting ways. And ever since that time, we've tried to live up to that expectation. You learn so much about leadership, about what it means to be a part of something bigger than yourself, about meeting others from around the world, how to network, and it's just an incredible opportunity that I am so thankful that I've had and so thankful that I have the opportunity to help others have. No matter what decade teens may be from, there's still fundamental needs that they all have. The need to feel connected to a part of something bigger. The need to have authentic relationships with each other. The need to feel like they're contributing to society. These are exactly the kind of things that BBYO provides. It feels like home. It, it really, really does. Um, my best friends that I talk to every day are in BBYO. Um, the people that feel like family. My role models have all come from BBYO. The girls that I try to take under my wing and be an inspiration to are all in BBYO and I think BBYO has really been one of the best things that's ever happened to me. What was most important about it for me was that I established a number of friends uh, and our established relationship with a number of friends and uh, those friends have continued to be my friends uh, for life. We learned to be leaders in BBYO. We didn't realize it at the time, but today as we run meetings, uh, as we speak in front of audiences, many of the skills that we learned as BBYO chapter leaders, as regional leaders, uh, come to the fore uh, yet again. The most important lesson I've learned at BBYO is how to lead, and that's something that without BBYO I wouldn't be able to do. I wouldn't be able to lead chapter conventions, regional conventions, speak in front of a crowd of thousands without what BBYO has taught me. In your younger years, your role is to just be inspired and to take in all of the amazing things that BBYO does and uh, get to know the older members who, who see potential in you. And I think what's great about BBYO is it gives people the opportunity to try something new, to run a program, to start a new chapter initiative. If you multiply that impact by all of our members, we, we create a storm. And that's what I want us to do. Everything of who I am and what I've become is so much a part of how I was raised in BBYO and what I've learned. So when they asked me to chair the board and pass it on to the next generation, I couldn't think of a more impactful organization than BBYO. It's dynamic, it's youthful, and making a difference for teenagers around the world. So in Bulgaria, our parents know nothing about Jewish community, but us, my generation, we, were, we started as youngsters, we started as children with the summer camps, with BBYO and everything else. So BBYO helped us find our Jewish identity and teach it to our parents. Because unlike the natural situation where the parents teach, in Bulgaria and most of the ex-communist countries, the kids teach the parents what being Jewish is. Esty, Elliot, Stuart and I all came from small Jewish communities and it meant everything to us. It was our entire social life. It was a chance for us to connect with other young Jews, to be part of a Jewish community and to feel part of something bigger than ourselves. We knew that we were part of a global movement. We knew that we weren't just individuals in a little town without a lot of Jewish friends. And those connections uh, have propelled us I think all of us are very connected to the idea of Jewish peoplehood and committed to creating a global Jewish community. And we got our start through BBYO. Thank you so much for believing in us and for believing in the Jewish youth who will be the Jewish leaders of the future. This evening I'd like to congratulate Stuart, Elliot, and Esty on all that they've done to help BBYO become the organization that it's become after 90 years. And to thank all of you for contributing to all that this organization has to offer the young Jewish teens in this world and for setting our community on a course where it's enriched by the hope and the aspirations of a generation that knows no bounds.